Hi, in this video, we are going to show you how to take the complete backup for the 8060, 8065 or 8070 control. Regardless of the control model, the procedure remains the same. We will cover two ways of doing the backup in this video. Let's get started. So while you are in front of the control, we will press Ctrl I on the keyboard. Ctrl I. It opens up the diagnosis screen. Now from this diagnosis screen, you can see from the bottom menu, there is an icon called Report Fagor. We will click on Report Fagor. A message comes up in the middle of the screen. We will click on Yes. Now you can see from the bottom bar that the backup is in progress. It is generating one zipped file with the name Report Fagor under C Drive CNC8070 Diagnosis Folder. Now, depending on the control model, whether you are using 8060 or 8065, this CNC8070 name could also be as Fagor CNC. This report Fagor file includes machine parameters, user programs, OEM programs, and also the log file, which can we can also call it as a black box because it keeps track and stores the history of the control operation. So now we will press escape to get out of the screen. For second way of backup, we will press emergency stop push button on the machine. Now we will press escape to get uh, to clear this message so it's not covering up our screen. After this, we will go to utilities by pressing the utilities key on the keyboard. It opens up the explorer window. Now before we start the backup, we will uh, select the folder from the left side where we want the backup to be saved. We recommend using public folder as this is the folder that is open, unprotected and shared by default. So I selected public folder. Now we will create a new directory. I select new directory and I can give it any name. I will say backup 2020 and then you click on OK. So that creates a new directory under public folder. So we will select this folder backup 2020 now we will press the plus we will select the plus from the bottom menu and then it gives us the option of whether we want to take the backup or restore backup so we will click on backup it opens up the window where uh, it gives us the options of all the data that will be stored under uh, backup so it uh, the CNC will create individual zipped files for all these uh, fields which are check marked. We recommend uh, taking the complete backup for uh, any time you take the backup. So uh, as you can also see the drive parameters are grayed out right now because there are no digital drives connected at the moment. So once we have the digital drives connected it will uh, give us the option to select that as well. So now we will click on OK. So message comes up you click OK again now it is going to be generating individual backup for each and every data under public backup 2020. So once the backup is completed, the CNC will prompt us to restart the application. You just have to press escape and the application will restart by itself. And after that, you can uh, use your machine. If you found this video helpful, please give us a like and subscribe to our channel for more content. If you have any suggestions, please feel free to leave comment below. Thank you.